Welcome, YouTube. I'm Mujio with Dion, and today I'm bringing you another strategy. Today's strategy is called the Imperial Wall Strategy. The Imperial Wall Strategy is a strategy that consists of a line spam. This is basically at least 10 line infantry, about 4 lights, and about 5 cavalry. There are three different armies that can pull this composition off. There is Austria. Let me show you here. Austria can pull this army off. And Spain can also pull this army off. Let me show you here. Where is it? There we go. Spain can also pull this composition off. 10 on infantry, 4 light infantry, and 5 cavalry. Today I'm going to be using the Portuguese one. Uh, the Portuguese one is the weaker out of the, out of the options. It has very strong light infantry and it has a very weak line, basically. Because Portugal has no guards. So, you know, when you make it here, Okay, here we go. Can't put a shovel on anything, so I'm going to fight this opponent just to show you how to use the Imperial Wall strategy. Now, three factions that this is available to, each of them have the pros and cons. Now, Spain's usage of the strategy will have its infantry being a little bit more reliable and its cavalry being very reliable. And it has the highest morale of all three factions that can do this. Austria, his cavalry is a little bit reliant, and you can use his light infantry a little bit. And his infantry is not bad. Austria is well balanced when you use the strategy. And as for Portugal, his cavalry is bad, his infantry is alright, but his light infantry is very superb. So that's the trade off using this composition with Portugal. So those are the three pros and cons to each three factions that can pull this composition off. So here we go, I'm setting up my army. The way that you would want to set up the Imperial Wall strategy is very, very simple. All you gotta do is create a single line here. And you gotta have your cavalry in the back. Very simple formation. And uh, there you go, that is right there. Aw, oh, damn it, I forgot a line. Put it in right here. There you go, it's a very simple army to make. Hey, also, I'm going to go back in here. I stopped recording earlier because my connection disconnected. So, I forgot to mention that you can also do this with Prussia. So, yeah, there are four factions you can do it with. If you have Prussia, you can include the 8th Life Regiment. You can barely squeeze it in there to have this composition. And I think this is one of the more solid options, actually. You got good line, you got good lights, and you got not too bad cavalry. So, yeah, you got, you got Prussia, Portugal, Austria, and Spain. Alright, so I've got a new opponent here. I'm gonna start the battle. Okay, so again, it's a very basic setup. All you gotta do is put four lights up here, arrange them just like this, what I'm doing out here. All you like, make it into a single line. Find your lights like this. Kind of tug them in there a little bit. Are you cavalry? Like this. And you're all set. The good thing about the Imperial Wall strategy is that it's easy to set up, it's easy to ready up really fast. You can kind of throw your opponent off guard that way too. If you ready up fast like that, you can throw your opponent off, you can make him mess up and panic maybe because he's not used to readying up in just a minute's worth of time. It wouldn't work against an elite player, but it would definitely work against the average player. Um, looks like my opponent is not very good. He's got Grenadiers, more Grenadiers. Yeah, and hardly no cavalry at all. My opponent is not very good. This isn't going to be a very good example of what this army can do, but I am going to still show you how you can move with this army nonetheless. Because you got to know how to move with an army in order to be able to use it effectively. So you can get an idea how to use it against a better opponent.
Oh, that was not a very good battle. This guy just rage quit. But anyways, I think you could have more or less sought an understanding of how to use this army. I may do another one later since this guy rage quit. But anyways, this has been MGO Dion, and I will see you guys later.